last episode was that was a trip. There was a bed in here. Yeah. Quick man. Well the last episode I it was a good learning lesson. We learned that um, 10 mil are more accurate than hunting rifles, or at least the short ones. And it, we also learned that I make some really poor decisions. But it's been entertaining. An interesting little challenge for me. But we did get some weapons. Drop that guy. Pipe rifle. Yeah, that's that's got a scope on it, which is awesome. We did get a marksman sniper rifle. Those are gonna be a huge help. Now, if you've been watching, I did craft that at the very, very beginning of the game. So, I'm going to drop it. I don't want to be cheating. Let's dump that. That auto rifle. It may come in handy. heavy on the guns because as of right now I haven't repaired anything or modded any of the weapons. No nothing. We're looking like Yeah, our our armor sucks, but this is what we found so far. Interesting little thing. And we did level up. Open it up. What do we got? What do we got? Anything good? Magic 8 ball says outlook not so good. Too hot, is it? Well, not sure. I can get lock pick. Yeah, I'm gonna need it. loadout that I could have currently. Clearly I'm really, really limited. We do have a mission strength in numbers. Let's get some water here. Got some mashed taters. Let's head south into Flatwoods. Let's 
start looking in this direction on what we can find. We have to look for the overseer. Okay, those don't look friendly. not very accurate. The pipe rifle, yeah. Look at these guys. They're just sitting there chilling. Yep, it's cool. So let's scorch walk right by you. They're just standing there doing nothing, though. Mm. It's nice having a scope on this gun, but it does not have a whole lot of damage long range. But at least it is putting distance between me and some of the animals. Hey guys, what's going on? In the wasteland. You think I'm that sure you might want to? Sure, if I wanna... should be thrilled or terrified. Now I'm thinking about joining up, getting in on the ground floor. Yeah, you, th How about you? you think you want to get in Fort on the Atlas ground floor? Atlas is in good hands. Knight Shins trained us well. Mhm. Mm How about you shoot at some of the scorch? Mac and cheese. The scorch, the raiders, the ghouls. If anything tries to attack, we'll be ready. Oh, yeah, I could tell you guys were on top of killing those Scorched right there. <laughs> you guys are nailing it. Anyone who walked the whole length of the country just to get here has earned my attention. Yeah, well, those Scorched didn't earn your attention. Nice job. That helps out a lot. Yeah, doggy. Recoil on that thing sucks. up is hard work. I. Oh, how many of these do I have to look through? This gotta be the one. Okay, well, you're helpful. What's in here? Frag mine. Okay. It's hard work making a living out here. Oh. I'm in danger. That's great. Okay, run. And jump. And then jump up. <coughs> okay. Alright, I got bit. That's awesome. All rats 
was so helpful. Grab. Grab my junk. I don't have much. Overseer's log, town of Flatwoods. My God. There's no one here. The old tavern, the church. People were using them for shelter, but they're gone. Mutations we expected, but there's something else, a disease. I was attacked by, well, it used to be a person, but it had these green glowing lesions and its voice, angry, tortured. We are one, one what? Whatever happened here is beyond anything we expected. And we expected a lot. Before they were wiped out, the survivors called themselves the Responders. Looks like they were made of firefighters, police, emergency medical staff. They even have an automated system to teach people about treating water, food, survival. I'm doing their tests, and you should too. I know it's even worse than we imagined, but... Someone's got to know where the missile silos are, and how to secure them. The responders are the best lead we have. This is the Overseer, signing off. All right, we're starting the Overseer's journey here. So, let's go ahead and register. Here's register here. Alright. Keisha McDermott. Keisha. Kesha. Okay. Let's take a trip down by the river. did want to do real quick. Let's go to our settings and game. In quests. Miscellaneous events. Okay. Shut the events off. We're focusing on missions here. Stuff over here. Rifle, rifles, rug. Oh man. Play a bunch of crap that I am not gonna be able to use in this in this run. 
Drop that hollow tape. We don't need it. Um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna drop our scrap kits. When I first started this character, I accidentally picked up my uh, my daily stuff. But we're just gonna dump it. Don't want to be cheating. to all responders. The Mr. Farmhands are out of control. Testing. Evacuate civilians. Dasa has asked us all to Once document our stories for posterity, yeah. you know. Well, seems like a fine idea. So, hi. I am Kesha McDermott. Kesha. When the bombs fell, I was in Watoka. Okay coordinating a statewide science fair for that year's high school kids. And the theme was the future of energy. Any Brahmin over here? Hey. After the bombs, everything was pretty chaotic. <laughs> Scavenging for food and fighting off rabid survivors. Oh, it was just a bad time all around. I found a couple of surviving kids from the high school whose parents didn't make it. And we holed up in a house in town for a while. After a bit, I was able to solder the circuitry in an old radio, and we tuned in to a broadcast from the responders. Oh, we were overjoyed. The trip from Watoka to Flatwoods, it was rough, mind you. The kids and I ran into a group of assholes in the mountains who stole our food and water. I can't tell you how happy I was to find the responders in Flatwoods. Tents for everyone, open kitchens, medical supplies, protection. <laughs> we were safe. They had a problem, though. Their water sources were contaminated heavily. People were boiling water, but not long enough to make it safe. So, I stepped up and I said, I'll build a testing kit to monitor the contamination and I will teach folks how to properly boil water. <laughs> and I did. The world is getting better, but slowly. We need to make sure it doesn't relapse, too. It's going to take time and care, that's all. Well, time, care, and science. Okay. Just a tidbit. Duchess Tram. Coming at me quick. Guy wasn't messing around. Okay. Let's get back over here and we're gonna get to Kesha's. Check out what's going on with this water. Water sample, yes. Well, water. Okay. So we'll test. 
testing kit, air quality testing kit, or testing kit, it's Kesha. Kiosk. Cafeteria tray. Any luck? Any luck? No. to find Delbert winners to do one more experiment for the responders to become a full volunteer okay let's see they given me that caused me to go overweight. Let's drop the combat knife. Hatchet. A chetty. And I hate Molotovs. Normally I end up catching my stupid self on fire. That's the preacher guy. Alright. Let's go check his house. Give these a home. <sighs> ¿Qué pasó? Hola. Como esta usted? Ah, esta noche en Telemundo. Hombre es muerto. Yeah, he is dead. Reverend Delbert Winters here, born and raised in this very town. Ah, good. Met my own church to the responders for their outpost here, and uh, you're welcome. The responders are on a true mission, you see. Helping folks through thick and thin. Till the heavens open up again and take us all up anyways. When this all happened, I figured like most, it was time. This was the end. But, but it wasn't, was it? We're still here. At first, I thought it was a mistake. That we was missed, forgotten. Maybe we did some wrong. Didn't give it up to charity, maybe. Didn't praise his name, even in the worst of times. Maybe thought some things that ought not to have been thought. So I asked him. I asked how. Why? I fought you wars on Earth. I ready to fight them up there by your side. Then, in my despair, I 
I saw some survivors eating raw rat carcass behind a dumpster. You ought to cook that first, I warned them. Seemed obvious. We tried but got sick, they said, covered in their own filth. I realized right then and there that I was being tasked. From then on, I built kitchens, cooked good food, fed anyone who walked up with an empty belly. And I was thankful for my task in life. Thankful. <laughs> Next time hell or high water land in my stoop, I'll be swept clear away with it. But until then, let's share a home-cooked meal together, all right? Okay. So our mission from the computer was to locate some Brahmin meat and cook steak. Uh, we have crispy squirrel bits. I've seen... Do. Here's the ribeye. That sucks that I have to throw that away. Squirrel bits, gotta throw that away. Uh. So at this point, I'm not cooking anything. It's part of my crafting rule. how sustainable this is going to be. I have to see. Congratulations, we're a volunteer. Okay. Contact the responders. Where's that? say no to stem packs. I needed them big time on that last run. Well, again, I'm a volunteer. Right. Large horde of scorched. They're at Morgantown Airport. Mm. Okay. Well, it looks like we're going to have to head north. I'll see. Okay. Thank you. Let's see what we got up here. Poor guy. He did. Him dead. Grab my chunk. Nothing in the duffel bag. It sucks. Crap. Wasn't expecting that. Uh -huh. Whatever. What's going on here? It's Fiverr story. Colonel. Uh, hi. Dasa asked me if I would talk about, um, how I got here. She asked everybody, so I, I said okay. My, name, my name's Colonel, and I'm 13 years old. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. Um, the bombs and the messed up people and the cows with two heads, all of it. I was bad. Just bad. I, I cheated on my spelling test. I kicked Chip Wilkins in the shins until he cried. I pushed Rosie McCloy down the stairs. Um, I, I cut holes in the bottom of all the gym shorts and I put glue in the mashed potatoes in the cafeteria. I told Harold Newell to eat 10 dead flies a day in order to grow muscles and uh, I put Nuka-Cola in the rat cage water bottles at the pet store. And um, I just wanted to say I'm sorry about everything. My dad said if I wasn't this way, the bad things wouldn't happen. I haven't seen Daddy since the bombs, and I guess he left because of that, too. It's okay. I'm trying to be good now, though. I'm not old enough to 
be a volunteer, but Dasa said I could help collect food and water, so I'm getting better, I promise. And, um, Daddy, if you're listening, I, I promise I won't be bad anymore, so you can come back now. like that kid was a little prick. Can I try to walk toward the enemy? Because even while you're shooting it, it gives a increases your damage the closer that you are. Man, I'm gonna have to look at my ammo too and see what I've got. anything good in this safe. Like I said, I, I've only done one playthrough and I, I don't really know this game nearly as good as I should. balcony onto the shitter. Okay. We knew that though. Did remember that much. Ooh, survey the area. Heck yeah. Okay. Let's get down off of here. I'm overweight. I definitely gotta look at my ammo and see. What's useful and what ain't. And let's see. Okay, we're dumping the fuel. Might as well get rid of the arrows. I don't have any five five six stuff.
think I'm gonna have to get rid of all this junk. Get rid of that. Alright, let's check out our armor, because we've got a left leg. Damage resist a five, electric two. Yeah. That is a better armor. Alright. Like ten mil. Condition's pretty good. Target a mole rat. But I don't see it now. You fight those mole rats. There's one. Mole rat, go down there and get him. soldier. Sometimes it's deadly. Why is that guy in a suit? Huh. I don't know. Yeah, the Morgan Town. This is a bad thing when you first start because you don't have these these places, you know, tagged on your on your map and you can't fast travel to them. The world here is huge. Is that guy dressed nice? Huh. I don't know. I don't trust it. Okay. I tag that on the map. That's fine. if I tag it, I can travel back over there fairly quickly, just use it as a fast travel plan. Intruder, identify yourself. Well, that ain't, that, that ain't good. Oh, great. 
Yeah, those are cultists. No. Not this knee here. At least it's somewhat dark out. That does help conceal you. Gave me chills when I heard it. Ah, it's just about time to eat. Yeah. Oh, damn, no caps. Looks like there's almost two hundred dollars in here, though. I guess it'll make good kindling. the train station. Cherry. Hey. Let's store all my junk. Got some of the weight off of me. If you have supplies yeah, I, to trade, I can I be say, of service. I can't buy anything from vendors. But that made me think about it. I didn't say I couldn't sell anything to vendors. So. Now, trading for supplies, ammunition, and I gear. I don't know what I would do with the money. Um, yeah, I have no idea. And then the other thing is, I said no energy weapons. It's, this is a primitive run, which okay, welcome responder. I am authorized to trade supplies. It got me thinking about the stealth boys, and I kind of, kind of feel like that's. Well, that's not a primitive item. It sucks. What do you do? You know, I set the rules because I'm an idiot. Five, ten mil. I think I'm all right on shotgun shells. Okay, well, 
We're right at 45 minutes or so. I was telling you guys before, I don't want to make the videos too awful long. I know this one wasn't extremely exciting. We we're more or less traveling. I didn't have the option to fast travel over here at the time. fast travel over here so it was quite a little walk. Ooh, here's a bed though. Triage center terminal. Take control. Disengage lock, yes please. What do we got? Is there anything good in there? Stem pack. Okay. Thank you. I want to lay in that bed. Why can't I lay in the bed? That acts. Impact right away. Yep, can't use that bed. bed there. That's awesomely inconvenient. Can't remember if there's one up there or not. if there's going to be a million of them come running or well, my brackets are going out so I think I'm good Not. Why would there? It's been a hell of a week, I tell ya. I we agree. lost more good people fighting off those damn scorched things again. Now I got Chavez telling me we're picking up a new radio signal. Someone's asking for help. She wants me to take my team and follow it till we find them. Can't be too far. Already tracked to gaining strength south of here. Problem is, we'd have to go straight on through Raider country to find them. And I don't have the time or men to spare right now. So, I hate to say it, but I gotta tell her it ain't gonna happen. Not now. My team's the last line of defense. And if I take them on some wild goose chase, we're leaving ourselves open for another Christmas flood situation. And you can bet your ass I ain't gonna let that happen again. Even if it means someone out there might need us. Oh, man alive, times have changed. Okay, 
Okay, well. This was fairly uneventful. Definitely most boring episode. But that's okay. That's, that's kind of what you gotta do sometimes. There's no way to to get anywhere other than walking. I don't have the option to fast travel on on untagged locations. Is there a bed? Oh, thank you. Thank you, God. Ooh, treasure map. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Wait, some pack, bobby pin. Heck yeah. All right. Can we level up? Yes, we can. Anything good? And then we're going to go ahead and go to bed. Take a nap. Slinger. And I, I think I'm going to kick the, uh, might kick that gun up a little bit higher. That honestly might be my best bet for right now. So let's go to agility. Faster regeneration. Yep, let's upgrade the gunslinger. that one up. Action boy. I think what I want to do with that Yeah, let's do it. get me through for right now. Fusion cell. That does me no good. The paint can. No touch. Things haven't worked properly since the last scorched attack. Okay. Believe that. So, I think that's going to be it for right now. Not no really exciting run this time, but we had to do a lot of traveling, and that's just part of it. It's just how the world works sometimes. So, this looks like a really clean bed, and uh, yeah, here, let's just... We'll cuddle up to this half-eaten corpse, and there, there you go. Yeah, rest your head on his feet. <laughs> All right. Well, join me next time, and hopefully uh, it's definitely going to get more interesting because I have to go into the airport. And 
That should be interesting. It's gonna be fun. So, thanks for joining me.